Let's just stray with a quick check in for the collective. Hope that everyone is feeling amazing. There could be a fire sign involved. Something about someone not releasing, not letting go. Um, someone here is trusting their guide. Someone here is trying to either block someone's soul purpose or someone's not focused on their soul purpose. Um, there's some sort of a situation where something there's no unconditional love and there's like a third party that's very clingy. Um, so I'm just going to grab one. Communication reverse. So there's something about a phone call um, and like a problem with friendship group. Um, something about a phone call, a friendship group, a lack of friends, uh, get friend, friendly gathering, a problem with a social dynamic, um, someone's not calling, someone's not confessing, someone's not communicating, someone could feel stuck or trapped, it could have to do with these friends, um, someone's not calling, Wheel of Fortune Reverse, something is, someone's life just feels like a series of bad luck. Someone might feel like they ruined their life. Nothing is working out for them. Um, they could feel like the universe is against them. Eight of Wands reverse. Something could be backfiring, um, having to do with some sort of communication um, or energy backfiring. Somebody put something out there and now it's coming back. Someone could be doing something, or they've done something, taken some sort of frustrated action. It could have to do with a phone call. Um, and Knight of Swords Reverse, someone here is lashing out or angry or doing something here, maybe for revenge. There's a bully. It has to do with someone moving or leaving a situation or someone trying to... Yeah, okay, so someone's trying to move or leave, and there's someone here who... Um, if someone is trying to block communication or using a bunch of friends. There's something about a friendship group. Uh, maybe trying to... A lot of people involved. Um, deep down, there's something about an emperor. A masculine energy that's a leader. Um, maybe your match. Someone in, in the subconscious knows that there's a masculine energy that's a leader, um, a father figure, um, a boss, um, something about this person's significant, maybe this is what someone wants to be, or someone feels like someone's going to become if they come towards you, um, after things didn't work out with them, um, recent past, page of wands, nine of swords, someone's been really feeling like very anxious about some sort of adventure someone's on or some sort of message. Um, there could be a young, younger person um, involved in something that's creating a lot of anxiety, but I feel like this has to do with more uh, a message, anxiety, uh, um, some sort of nervous energy about a message, um, someone really thinking a lot. Someone doesn't love themselves, there's no love here, there's no new beginning. Someone really taking a lot of time, someone maybe taking a break. Maybe, um... Uh, intentions, expectations. This could go either way. Either somebody is trying to um, block someone from shining their light and doing it in a very underhanded way, and that's what someone expects. Or someone's feeling very hopeless about their future. Um, a lot of bad juju, a lot of infighting, conflict, um, shady behavior. Um, this could be someone trying to take someone down uh, who is being seen, loved, and celebrated. Or this could be someone who feels like they're about to fall from grace with a star reverse. Um, a Queen of Wands reverse might be falling from grace, um, maybe for trying to block or stop you um, from being seen, loved, celebrated. 
um, from experiencing a victory. Um, this has to do with some sort of bad memories or someone trying to block someone from returning to the past. Um, in their future. Hanged man. The chariot. Well, this feels like someone could be... <laughs> it's like someone's leaving or getting control of a situation, leaving a drama. It has to do with um, a strong spirit. Strong spirit. Someone's got control of a situation. Someone's leaving a situation. Um... Someone, someone is going to be forced to see something from a new perspective. There could be some sort of a break. Someone could be being even taken away. They can't really do anything about it. Someone could be being driven away in a car and they can't, they, someone's leaving. Someone is, can't stop something from happening here. Um, this could be uh, someone, people are really aware of, of some sort of lie or confusion that someone's causing. Uh, there could be a whole tower happening in the near future. With someone leaving, there could be something with this a car, the chariot. Um, someone could be getting handcuffed as well, hangman and chariot. Um, the lens someone's looking through, nine of cups. Feel like they feel like you are someone's happiness or you are happy and someone might feel like you know you're a wish come true um or you're experiencing happiness um and it has to do with you someone might have wanted you to be ostracized but you pursued you you um you were very diligent you, you continued on, you still continue on, and you continue on with like a lot of loving energy. There could be some sort of loving, new loving energy in your life as well, or someone just sees you as very sweet. Someone might have some sort of lofty, you know, in a, in a positive way, or they think of you in a dreamy way. Um, yeah, someone has a, sees you in a dreamy way and sees you as a dream come true, but it's like someone has only created bad memories here. It's like they can't return to the past. Um, someone could feel out in the cold in regards to you. They could be with someone that won't let go. Um, they feel like they they ruined their life in this situation with this Queen of Wands reverse. And this Queen of Wands Reverse is jealous because someone is looking at you like a dream come true or someone sees you happy. Something about your happiness is really bothering someone. Devil Reverse, someone's jealous. Um, jealous, someone it could be lying, still trying to cause confusion. Um, they could be receiving a no answer in their life. They could be just a lot of negative talk as well. Um, it's about this Ten of Pentacles and this Three of Wands in your energy, something coming your way, something that you're building, something, you know, building alliances. This is a very solid financial situation. This could be a family, a business, an inheritance. It's like you're happy and there's something to do with, like, a very solid financial situation that someone is looking at watching their concern with your money um wow um ace of pentacles reverse in the environment so this person seems to be taking some type of visible loss um and justice and eight of pentacles came out as well so this has to do with karma playing out maybe having to do with the workplace and everybody knows what's going on because this is all happening in the environment it's almost like they're losing something um, because they're taking some sort of loss in it and there's some sort of karma or some, something that is being distributed more fairly and it's happening in the environment and everyone knows. Um, 
if someone took something from you, um, it's, it seems like it's being returned or it has to do with the work that you put in. Nine of Pentacles fell on the floor as well. So this is you being very um, diligent, uh, doing something independently as it pertains to maybe your career, your job, your finances, a business that you've built, um, self-sustaining, practicing self-care. Um, so people know something about that, about you being very independent, um, doing something on your own and karma playing out in regards to work and someone taking some type of a loss. I feel like because with the justice here, they've always obviously done something unjust. Um, yeah, I feel like the Six of Wands has to do with some sort of fall from grace with this Ace of Pentacles reversed. They're taking a big financial loss. Um, and there could be some sort of evidence of something that someone's done here as well that's embarrassing, shameful, humiliating. Um, they could have tried to stop you from being seen and celebrated as well, and that could be what's causing them to fall from grace. They could have stolen something from you and that's what's being returned. There could be people uh, making something right around the workplace, um, your career, your business, and the environment. People who are seeing, seeing through an illusion that this person tried to create. Yeah, moon reverse. Um, a lot of lunacy being exposed and discovered. Hopes and fears, Ten of Wands. They're really worried about some sort of burden. Um, a lot on their plate. <sighs> yeah, this could be keeping up, having to do... They have a lot on their plate because they have to keep up. Maybe things are falling into place so easily, they can be very burdened um, to stay afloat. Uh, that Ten of Wands too, it could feel like guilt or shame. Um, and what's interesting is this feels like a shorter version of the last read. Um, so, you know, it's, it's, I feel like it's good to see because you can see it playing out a second time um, because the outcome in the last reading, the Ten of Wands was in the outcome along with the Death card. Um, so there's something very heavy here. It has to do with someone either not loving themselves or there could be a problem with the pregnancy as well. Um, yeah. This could be very disillusioned, but there could also be a problem with the pregnancy. Yeah, and someone not being able to hang on to someone, or let, they have to let go of power or security. Um, if this person lost their job, they, if they had a good paying job, they might have to do several jobs. There could be bills adding up. Um, yeah. Yeah. There's something about your temperance, you practicing the middle way, you being a very peaceful person. Um, that it's coming to light here um, versus someone who's been very disingenuous. It's, it seems like it's all coming to light. That could be the burden just being exposed. Um, outcome. King of Wands reverse. So there could be a masculine energy that it's caught up in this situation that gets exposed. Um, it's someone who doesn't want to take accountability in regards to you. Um, maybe they feel like um, someone else is going to take a fall, but I feel like they're next is what that is. Um, as far as their reputation goes, um, this is someone who refused to take accountability for a Queen of Cups in the Upright. Um, something going on to someone who's very loving, intuitive, empathic, um, sweet person. Um, there could be a group of people here that are all um, 
battling over some type of communication about you or with you. Um, so maybe we leave it here for now. Um, if you resonate, I hope that it helps. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.